Hey friends, we're on to chapter 8.4, number two. We are going to find some amount from a compound interest account. All right, here's the formula that we're gonna play with. Of course, P is the principal. One plus R is our rate, always as a decimal. N is the number of times that we compound per year. And as usual, T is the number of years. So we got to find the amount and we've got to find the interest. So let's make sure to answer both parts. For number two, the numbers that they give us are P equals 8,000. The rate equals 6%. I'm going to change that to 0 0.06 right off the bat. And it says the word annually. Okay. So when you hear that, annually is one time a year. Okay, and we're going to do this over three years. Okay, that's all the information that we need. We're just going to plug it all into our formula. We make a line there so it's a little bit cleaner. A equals 8,000. 1 plus 0 0.06 over 1 to the power nt. So that's 1 times three okay i hope you can see all that clearly as usual do everything that's inside the parentheses first and within the parentheses i have this division and then an addition okay so that's just eight thousand times 1.06 one times three is just three. Oh, pretty straightforward i'm gonna do my exponents first and then multiply it by eight thousand Okay, so I'm gonna get my handy calculator here. Clear, 1.06. Uh, this button here is the exponent key to the power three equals, and I get some long number there. Keep the long number, don't cut it off, and multiply by six, oops. Uh, ooh, how do I go back? Multiply it by 8,000. And I get this long answer i don't know if you could see it i'll write it down the amount equals nine thousand five hundred twenty eight dollars point one two eight now since we're talking about money i wanna just have two places after the decimal to get cents all right so my amount is actually nine thousand five hundred twenty eight dollars and this eight will round up that two to a three and I'll call it 13 cents, okay? That's actually just the first question. Where'd it go? Uh, find the amount. Part B says find the interest. That's just the principal. Um, oops, I lied. That's just the amount minus the principal. So I equals 9528.13 minus our initial $8,000, I equals $1,528.13. So with this investment, you will make $1,528.13 over three years doing absolutely nothing. And this, friends, is how the rich get richer.